I'm going to tell everyone the truth. Please don't do that. Get out of my life, Clara. Dad, we need to talk. Of course, Lisa. What is going on? Laura isn't who you think she is. What do you mean by that? Laura isn't really my sister. She is a liar. I don't understand that. Are you jealous of her again? No, I'm not jealous. I'm trying to tell you that Lara is lying. Her real name isn't even Lara. Her real name is Clara. She was trying to steal my life. Why can't you just accept them, Lisa? Why do you have to make up stories like this? She's already admitted it, Dad. Why don't you believe me? Tell him the truth right away, Clara. What do you say, Lisa? Tell him who you really are. I'm Lara, your sister. You know that. Tell him the truth or I'll hit you. Dad, why is Lisa so angry with me? Now it's enough, Lisa. Stop being so unfair to your sister. You're under house arrest for a week. Why am I in trouble now? She's the bad guy, not me. Come on, Laura, we're going out for an ice cream. Okay, Dad. Hey, Sarah, you won't believe this. What's up, Lisa? Do you have a minute or am I bothering you right now? I've got time. Tell me what's going on. Laura is a liar. I knew it. Her real name isn't Laura at all. She isn't really my sister either. Who is she then? She wants to steal my life. Oh my gosh. Yes, and do you know what the worst part is? What is it? My dad doesn't believe me. He is always on Lara's side. He probably feels guilty. Because he neglected your sister back then. Yes, that may be. What am I supposed to do now? She lives with me. Have you tried talking to your mom yet? No, that's a good idea though. She might believe you. You're right. I'm going to try and talk to her. All right. Tell me how it went then. 
I'll do that. When are you going to Australia now? My parents have postponed the move. We're only leaving in two weeks. All right. I'm going to talk to my mom now. I'll get back to you afterwards. Okay, Lisa. A lot has happened. Thanks for the help, Sarah. I would love to do that. Mom, I need to talk to you. It is very important. Of course, darling. What is there anyway? Please promise me that you'll believe me. Okay, I promise. Laura is not my sister. I don't understand you. She is an imposter mom. Now I understand why your father grounded you. Why are you making it so difficult for us? You're going to have to accept your sister. Why does no one believe me? Sarah, it didn't work. Your mom didn't believe you? No, she's on Clara's side too. Is there only one option then? What did you think of? We need to find your real sister. What do you mean by that? If we find the right Lara, your parents must believe you. How are we supposed to find them? I know someone who can help us. Okay, super. I'll talk to him. All right. So I'll see you at school tomorrow? Yes, that's right. See you tomorrow, Lisa. Hey, Sarah. Did you talk to the spy? Yes, I have that. I've got good news. He found the right Lara. What really? But that was quick. Yes, he is a very good spy. Where is Lara? She is also here in Munich. Perfectly. But she goes to another school. Let's go there. Okay, I'm in. So this is Lara's school. Yes, the spy said that. How do we find them now? He showed me a picture of her. I'll recognize them. She's apparently in fourth grade. So we just need to find their classroom? Yes, that would be good. There are a few rooms up front. I think I see a sign. 
it says fourth grade. What are you two doing here? You're not in our class. Excuse me, we're looking for someone. Who are you looking for? We're looking for Lara Peters. Is there a Lara Peters in the class? Yes, I am. I need you to come along for a minute, please, Lara. It's a long story. I don't even know you. I'll explain everything to you along the way. Can I go with them both, Mrs. Coons? Yes, you can, Lara. But you must be back here in two hours. Okay, I'll be back in two hours. Would you like to have an ice cream today, Lara? Yes, that would be great, Mom. Of course. You get everything you want. What are you doing here? And who is your new girlfriend, Lisa? That's the right Lara. No, that can't be true. Is that true, Lara? She is wearing a wig and contact lenses. That's what Clara really looks like. We're so sorry, Lisa. We didn't want it to be true. But you were right. Hello. I am Laura Peters. Lisa told me the story. We're so sorry, Laura. We weren't here for you back then. My parents have already told me that I am adopted. Would you like to be part of our family, Laura? I still have to think about that. Actually, I already have two parents. But I would really like to have a sister. And a new best friend. Of course. I'm always here for you, Lara. Thank you, Lisa. What are you going to do now, Lara? I don't know. My whole life was turned upside down today. Let us know if there's anything we can do to help. I'll do that. I think I'll talk to my parents first. They might also want me to stay here for a while. Yes, that would be great. I would be happy to hear that. Me too. I've never had a sister before. From now on, you've got one. Awesome. I'm going now. I really need to talk to my parents. All right. See you later, Lara.
We're really so sorry, Lisa. We didn't believe you. Even though you're our daughter. We should have listened to you. And I scolded you too. I wasn't a good mom. I'm really sorry, darling. No problem, mom and dad. You didn't mean it badly. I needed to open your eyes. You did that correctly. How did you find Laura anyway? I only managed to do that with Sarah's help. She knows a spy. He found Lara's school and sent us a photo. I was happy to help, Lisa. What's next? I hope that Lara will join us. And would like to be part of our family. I hope so too. Let's see what her parents have to say about it. Hey mom, hey dad. I need to talk to you for a minute. Of course, Lara. What can we do for you? I met my real parents today. You've done something? I met Mr. and Mrs. Peters. How did that happen? A girl came to our school. She said she was my sister. Her name is Lisa. And then? She said she needed my help. So I went to see her. You just go into strangers' houses? Why are you doing that, Lara? But Dad, they're my real parents. What happened then? I met Mr. and Mrs. Peters. They want me to stay with them for a while. I can't believe it. They're not your real parents, Laura. We're your parents. We raised you. We've taken care of you. They were never there for you. But Dad, I want to spend time with my sister. You can do that. But not with her parents. The two have already done enough work. Okay, Dad. Can you believe that, Martha? The two simply come after ten years. And want to spend time with Laura. It's really unbelievable. We should go to them. And tell them what we think. That is a good idea. They're going to hear something. Who are you? And what are you doing in our house? 
Am I here with Mr. and Mrs. Peters? Yes, that is correct. Do we know each other? Not yet. But that's about to change. We're Lara's parents. She told us what happened. How dare you talk to our daughter like that? We only offered Laura to be a part of our family. If that's what she wants. That is unbelievable. Especially after you've just given Laura away. We raised them. And we took care of them. We're their real parents, not them. We only offered it to Laura. The decision is up to her. But we don't see it that way. They've already done enough. Laura won't be spending any time near you. Is that clear? We'll see about that. Hey mom, hey dad. When will we finally see Lara again? Can she stay here for the weekend? I'd love to. The main thing is that I don't have to see her parents. They're really funny. What happened then? Lara's parents don't like us. What does that mean for us? We probably won't see Lara anymore. Sorry, Lisa. But I want to see my sister. Our hands are tied, Lisa. Hey, Lara. We've got a problem. Hey, Lisa. Yes, our parents had a fight. What should we do now? I don't think we can do anything. Let's just wait and see. Maybe they'll calm down again. Yes, that would be great. Then we can spend more time together. I wish that too. Okay, I'll get back to you in a few days. All right, I'll see you soon. Good morning, Sarah. Hey, Lisa. Is everything okay with you? Well, my parents had a fight with Lara's parents yesterday. What has happened? Lara's parents are angry. They don't want Lara spending time with us. Why is that? They think we're a bad influence on Lara. But that is not good. What about Lara? What do you mean? 
Does she want to spend time with you? Yes, I think so. Then we'll have to convince her parents. Come on, we'll fix it. Lisa, Sarah, what are you doing here? We'd like to talk to them, Mr. and Mrs. Meyer. My parents told me about the fight. You have nothing to do with it, Lisa. It's not your fault. I'm sorry you're getting involved in this. I'd really like to get to know Lara better. We're sisters, after all. The problem isn't you, it's your parents. They are not reliable. We can't trust them. But Lara also wants to spend time with us. How do you know that? I spoke to her. And what is your suggestion? Lara could stay with us over the weekend. Just for one night. Then we can get to know each other better. I'm not sure if that's a good idea. Please give us a chance. You won't regret it. I promise. What do you think, honey? If Lara really wants that, I agree. Okay, we'll give it a try. But just for one night. Thank you, Mr. and Mrs. Meyer. All right, we'll pick Lara up again tomorrow morning at nine o'clock. I'd love to. Thank you for your trust, Mr. and Mrs. Meyer. We're going to take good care of Lara. We promise you that. How long does Laura stay with Lisa? A. One night. B. Two nights. C. One week. Write a comment.